resizing videos with mpeg slash of conf to fit into static sized player. I have a HTML5 video player which is 700px wide, 400px high. I'm trying to use of conf to use mpeg to resize, while retaining the aspect ratio, and making sure it fits into my player. Input can be a file of any size, so I need to resize the larger ones but center the smaller ones with black bars. So far I've tried, S and aspect, I've seen pad being used with the VF switch but don't understand how it works enough to get what I need. This is a rough idea of what I need. I'm not sure if it's even possible. It's almost like CSS's max width slash max height. I realize this may just be a jumble of words but if anyone happens to understand what I'm talking about, I'd appreciate help, thanks. Of conf command. A simple method is to use the force underscore original underscore aspect underscore ratio option in the scale filter. Original image represents a 640 by 480, 4 to 3 aspect ratio video. In these examples the original image will be scaled to fit into a 1280 by 720, 16 to 9 aspect ratio output while preserving the original aspect ratio. To do this you can either add black bars, or any other color, with pad filter to pillarbox or letterbox the image to fit properly, or Use the crop filter to cut off the excess. Pillar box or letter box to fit. Pillar boxed image. Fitting a 640 by 480, 4 to 3, input into a 1280 by 720, 16 to 9 output. This will upscale the image. If you want to avoid upscaling see the example below. Letterboxing will occur instead of pillarboxing if the input aspect ratio is wider than the output aspect ratio. For example, an input with a 2.35 to 1 aspect ratio fit into a 16 to 9 output will result in letterboxing. Crop to fit. Cropped image. 4 to 3 input aspect ratio, 16 to 9 output aspect ratio. Using the crop filter to cut off the excess. Using input images that each vary in size. If you are inputting a series of images, and the images vary in size, Add the eval equals frame option in the scale filter, such as Changing the background color Use the color option in the pad filter You can provide a hex value or use a supported color name Here's the command that it add pillar or letterboxing for a fixed output width it's a tad long, but you'll have to specify the padding some way. First, in your shell define output width and height. Then run the command. This is stripped down to the bare essentials needed to resize and pad, add your other video and audio options as you see fit. Note that the numbers for width and height have to be divisible by 2 in order to work for most codecs. Here's the explanation of what's going on. Scaling First we need to figure out whether to scale by width or height. To do this, we divide the output width by the input width, and output height by input height. This will give us the scale factors for each dimension. 
We then check which one is lower, with min, and choose only that factor for resizing. Finally, we multiply both input width and height by that factor, u min, column e min. Padding Dollar width column dollar height is the output width and height. To figure out where to place the resulting video, we need to subtract the scaled width from the maximum output width and the scaled height from the maximum output height. The scaled widths and heights are the expressions from the scale filter. We divide the resulting offset by 2 to add borders at both sides. It seems to me that you need to do this in three steps. Check the input aspect ratio. Scale videos with a DAR and GT, 7 fourths width wise, change the width to 700, and scale the height to keep the aspect ratio, and scale those with DAR and LT, 7 fourths height wise. Pad the video so that it fits in the 700 to 400 space. Fmpeg slash ofconv can do the scaling slash padding with video filters in a single step, transcoding only once. For example, to take a 16 to 9 video, scale it widthwise, and then letterbox the results. But for the first step, detecting the aspect ratio and comparing it to the 7 to 4 you require, you'll have to use a script of some kind. We'll get you the video's aspect ratio, which will look like 16 to 9 or 4 to 3. In a bashed script, I'd use something like Obviously you'll have to adapt it to your needs.